Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Kilani K here and on Instagram. I am going to leave my social media right over here so you guys can follow me if you guys like. So for today's video, I am really excited because I am finally, I know I am super late, but I am finally reviewing and trying on the new Huda Beauty foundation. I don't know if we can even call it new anymore because it's been out for a while. Uh, but I ordered this foundation on the VIB uh, sale that Sephora had, so that's why it took me a while for me to get, but it's here, so let's do it. I actually got it yesterday, and today is Thanksgiving, so happy Thanksgiving to everybody. I hope you guys had a great Thanksgiving with your family and friends. Um, but yeah, I'm excited. I couldn't wait to just review this and get this out because we all need to find out what the tea is about this foundation, okay? So I obviously did my research and I looked around on YouTube, Instagram, literally everywhere to kind of find like, you know, the shade that I needed. But also when I was doing the purchase on Sephora, they were out of a lot of the shades of foundation. So I would have a limited amount of range for me to pick from. So um, I went with uh, Dulce de Leche, a 350G. Um, I don't know, this might be maybe a tad um, lighter than my skin tone, but we i'm gonna try to make it work for this video and if it's not that good i'll probably just exchange it for another one the problem is that my uh local sephora does not carry this foundation so i would have to you know like return it and then rebuy it online and that takes a while so i didn't want to wait all of that so i'm just gonna get this video out for you guys now okay anyways now let's talk about the packaging i love the box it is very huda beauty inspired pretty much it is a black box with huda beauty and just the same thing like huda in white and beauty in pink it says hashtag fox filter foundation um it talks about the foundation a little bit in the back and how to apply it it says on the directions here use a pump or less apply foundation evenly all over the face with a dense brush or beauty sponge for best application paired with the huda beauty complexion perfection pre-makeup base I did not get any of that. I didn't get the brush. I didn't get anything. I literally just got the foundation. So I'm going to apply it with my best, you know, um, damp uh, beauty blender because that's how I apply pretty much everything. I really don't think I use any um, face brush to like apply foundation or anything like that because I don't really like it. So that's how I'm going to apply it today. So let's see how this goes and yeah, let's get into it. Before I apply the foundation, I am going to go ahead and apply this primer. This is the No Pore, Pore, Pore Blem Primer by Touch In Souls. This is my favorite primer. If you guys follow me here on YouTube, you guys know because I've used it quite a couple times. Um, but yeah, I'm going to apply this all over my face. And then I'm going to color correct a little bit on this dark damn pimples that I have on my face. And I'll go back to applying the foundation. So I'll be right back. Now that we're back and I look all crazy, I know, we'll fix that in a little bit. Um, I am just going to go ahead and open this bad boy up and see what the packaging looks like. I mean, pretty sure you'll see it, but, you know, I gotta be a little extra with the video. Um, yeah, this is what the packaging looks like. It is a beautiful ombre uh, bottle. Um, I was reading a lot of people were like, kind of like, you know, complaining about the uh, bottle being plastic I don't mind it myself just because you know if you do travel a lot you can take this bottle and not be so afraid that it's gonna break or anything like that and if you drop it or anything if you're clumsy like me and you drop things um, I mean it can break but it's not as easy as a um, glass bottle breaking see what I'm saying so I actually do like it I love the bottle the bottle is so pretty it looks so expensive but it's probably not because it's plastic but i love it it has the name at the bottom like i said dulce de leche 3350 g and yeah nice i can't remember how much this foundation was i believe 40 dollars which is kind of like on the higher side i will put the price right over here because i might be wrong but you know the price is kind of like higher because you know the um 
what is wrong with my words today so i am going to take the back of my hand and put um a few pumps oh my god it might be a little too light for me you know you know how you know like i use a lot of foundations and when you see it you know you know when you know but i'm still gonna go with it it looks really thick by the way so okay we might be able to make it work we might be able to make it work fam my face looks like a ghost but in person it looks perfectly fine actually like i'm okay with it because you know you applied all the contours and all of that and you know your face becomes a little bit darker after the foundation but i really like it it's super full coverage it's super super nice to blend out my beauty blender works just fine with it um yeah I'm loving it so far so good I just wonder like how it will look after a few hours which I'm going to do that I'm going to do not finish up my makeup but do a little something something have another video to do and come back later on and then probably later on tonight again just so for you guys see like the wear out throughout the day because that's always good you know because at the moment everything is good but then later on it oxidizes and you know all of that good stuff so wow this actually looks like legit like a fox filter this is insane i love this foundation so much i am actually just gonna go ahead and do that other video that i need to do real quick and you know just let the foundation set and do all of these all of its magic and I'll be right back with you guys in a little bit just to check on the foundation for now like I said I think it's great the application was super easy super blendable uh, the color I don't know how it looks on camera but in person it's perfect I think I grabbed the perfect color for me it matches my neck it matches everything so I'm kind of loving it and living for it so um, yeah I'm just gonna do my thing and i'll be back with you guys in a couple hours see you guys hey guys so welcome back it it's been about two hours since i first applied the foundation on my face and uh, you know i did a makeup look and i went to help out put the table for thanksgiving and everything and now we're here and let me tell you when i say i don't know how good this looks on camera but in person it literally looks like a filter like it is so like smooth and like it filters everything out like your skin looks like skin but still like flawless like i don't even know how to explain it it's so beautiful i absolutely love it and i didn't even like set my whole face i just said like my under eyes and you know a little bit for uh, that cut con contour and uh, yeah and ah uh, actually at the end um you know after i was done with my makeup <clears throat> sorry i sprayed this uh sephora perfection miss nude glow but i literally just put it like on top of my highlight that was it so honestly i did not set my whole foundation so i don't know how it's gonna look maybe later on throughout the day and i'm not gonna touch up after here i'm actually just gonna go eat with my family and then i'm gonna come back later on tonight to show you guys what the foundation looks like throughout the day i'm probably gonna go out with my mom she wants to go to target i don't know what else she wants to go to target for on thanksgiving but whatever so i'm gonna go out a little bit and you know try uh kind of like wear it out and see how it looks later but for now girl i'm loving this can you see the highlight though by the way <laughs> 
you guys I am kind of upset right now because I did not know that in the box you actually get like a sample size of the primer fail like I total I totally could have used this to like you know try the foundation out for the first time oh man but I'm probably gonna use it in some other video and show you guys but yeah just in case you guys get it you do get a little like sample primer in your box for you to try so you know you can try it that's really smart of her you know if you really love it you go and you purchase the whole full size smart huda smart okay we're back we're back we're back we're back we're back anyways it has been about five hours five hours since I applied this foundation and it is looking so good guys like I have not touched up anything um, I went and I ate with my family I actually went to Target with my mom and I just got back and this foundation looks freaking amazing I love it so much um, I think the shade that I grabbed was perfect for me I think that the application is amazing of the foundation I actually when I show you guys and I put uh, three pumps in the back of my hand that's all it took for my whole face and I applied it with my damp beauty blender it was great that's how I apply my foundation because I feel like it makes your skin looks more like skin and this is what this foundation does it is like a fox filter um, it is full coverage but you still see your skin like it makes your skin just look flawless I don't know it's just I am in love with this foundation like I said before um, it is on the higher uh, higher like price because it's like 40 bucks and but I think every bit of it is worth it it comes with a pump which is amazing you get every little bit of out of your foundation um if you are of like a makeup artist or something like that it is great that it's plastic because you're not you don't have to worry about so much like raking or anything like that that is not an issue for me being plastic i heard a lot of people actually complain about the bottle being plastic but i still love the foundation i love it huda you did amazing um it is a little bit hard if you don't know much about makeup and you don't know much about your shade and stuff like that to buy it just up online but I actually heard uh, another friend on Instagram she said that there is a guide for you to uh, do like in detail exactly what your color or something like that if I find it I'll probably link it down below so you guys can check it out and if you're looking into buying this maybe that can help you pick your shade but um, for me I didn't have a lot of choice and I'm pretty good when it comes to picking my shades since I've used so many foundations by now so but yeah I love this foundation I think it's so nice it cover up your pores it literally leaves your skin looking flawless or whatever you know you need this foundation anyways guys this is the end of this video if you guys like this video please give it a thumbs up if you don't like it give it a thumbs up that's fine just don't forget to subscribe at the end of this video so that you guys don't miss any of my videos and turn that little bell at the bottom so that you remind it when i post because if not you're literally going to miss my video we are going to do a big giveaway when i get to a thousand subscribers so please tell your mom your brother your sister your boyfriend your site chick everybody to subscribe to my channel so that when we get to a thousand we can get this giveaway rolling Anyways, guys, uh, thank you guys so much for tuning in, and I will see you guys on my next video next Sunday. So much love, and see you guys next week. Bye.